This is a fig tree that we moved from our old house. My brother-in-law and I dug it up, brought it over here, plopped it in the ground, and guess what? It did not live. So we are going to remove it and replace it with a uh, plum tree. If it never took root, then it might just pull out of the ground. I'm gonna... Wow, yeah, no, it's just coming apart. Oh, good Lord. Yeah. Uh, I'll get it down so I can get a good grip on it. Good Do you think it'll pull through? <laughs> oh, man. God, I don't know if that's a mold or what. Yeah, I think it's just rotten. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, it makes me so sad. Because <laughs> it's so definitely dead. You know, like, like you, you have hope until it just turned black. Maybe it's just shocked from the move. Exactly. Maybe but it's not used to its new school yet. <laughs> Man. Okay. If it comes up in one hunk, that means I don't have to dig as much of a hole. Ah. Oh, there it goes. Okay. I'll yeah. process that for the fire pit later. Yeah, it looks like the roots just never yeah. grew. Well, there might have been like a little bit of something no. at the bottom there. Maybe? No. No. Step one. Wake up, brother, gonna rise in the sun. Step two. Get some good, some food in you. Step three. You grow hard about what you want to be. Step four. Everybody just do your thing. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. 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 Set your affirmations, aspirations. I got shit to do. The aftermath of preparation. Go through, go through, blood and circulation. One step at a time. Yeah, that's how you make it. Set a goal, you control it. Any steps you take them. I try to pick one thought, have some concentration. And if I make a mistake, it's called education. I try to do this every day, call it replication. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. He's just real long. Today's gonna be a good day. Oh, those are beautiful Italian prints. If it flies out the back of this beat, I'm gonna be doing something seriously wrong. It, the base is crammed in. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Faster work with the starter hole, though. It actually didn't take me and Adam very long when we uh, did the original because the ground was nice and soft. It's a four in one plum tree. So it should be self fertilizing or self pollinating rather because it'll have four different trees in one spot and it'll take up less space that way. A self leveling plum tree would be even funnier though. <laughs> I think it's probably pretty close. That's not a good kicker. You want me to roll this? Let's see if it did it. Yeah, push down on it. Oh. Like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll widen it a little. <laughs> okay. Do you want me to do any of this? No, I'd rather it get done. Oh. <laughs> Another benefit of... Uh, Getting it, getting it to in the existing hole is that we've already called utilities. We already know where the lines are. We don't have to do that again. Yeah. <sighs> and we're not doing it during the dry weather because during the summer, this ground would be hard as a rock. But right now it's moist. Oh, that well, looks about right. Yeah. What do you think? Just a touch deeper, about like that. No, that's perfect. That's level. Okay. So stinking excited for this tree. It's already as buds, so hopefully it'll. Oh. Best buds. It looks like it's got buds throughout, so hopefully, hopefully it'll already be started and do well. 
And we asked, like, so our garage is right there, and our house is right there. You know, it's a relatively small yard because, you know, Portland. And they said that that wouldn't be a problem if the roots were not going to be invasive and cause our basement to leak or anything. That we just needed to be concerned about whether or not we could actually reach the tree, which we can. I'm super excited about this. 